Hi, I'm Dr. Kenneth Ngo. I am the medical director for the Brain Injury Rehab Program here at Brooks Rehabilitation Hospital. Particularly over the last 10 years, a lot of the care has been transitioned quickly from the hospital setting to the home, to outpatient, and to the community. So thankfully, Brooks had planned ahead and anticipate that change and have the whole spectrum of uh, services to care for patients with brain injury. And we're also venturing out to test new technologies. So one of the highlights is the Cyberdyne technology that we have adapted over the last two years. Uh, Brooks is the only center in the nation that adapted this technology early, utilizing it and learning it and hopefully sharing with the rest of the world on how uh, it will help patients. I think, in my opinion, I think there are many misconceptions about brain injury. And, and one of the most common misconceptions is that if a patient looks fine from the outside, that everything is fine. And I think that's a, a, a difficult topic to uh, discuss and to convey that the brain is very complicated. I think we all know that. But when a brain doesn't work properly, it's difficult to show that. You have to spend time and really understand how the brain works normally and how to tease out what's abnormal and what's not. We were one of the first centers in the nation to aggressively mobilize patients who are in the disorder of consciousness. We involve patients' family very early on. Um, we hold team meetings uh, regularly to discuss progress, and it is data-driven. Our program has been in existence for over 30 years, so with that experience of caring for patients in the disorder of consciousness that give us uh, uh, an advantage in caring for these patients. Things may be different now, but the ability to participate in all of those activities that one was able to do before, now able to do that uh, after the injury. And that is the most rewarding part uh, of our rehabilitation.